New for you this morning, food scarcity is a big problem here in Idaho. Right now, more than 200,000 Idahoans are considered food insecure. And the Idaho Food Bank wants to change that. Brenda joins us right now to tell us more about a new partnership with the Food Bank that aims to help more people in our community. Brenda, tell us about it. Yeah, Maggie, well, the Food Bank is now partnered with the Duck Valley Indian Community, which is on the Idaho slash Nevada state line. They say they want to help provide more food assistance to Native Americans through a new pantry located on the Duck Valley Reservation and to try to further their understanding of how to help ease the struggles of individual communities. The COVID-19 pandemic has brought forth many challenges, several being the rise in food prices and supply chain shortages. Despite those challenges, the Idaho Food Bank continues to help bridge the gap for food insecurities in the state, including Idaho's five Native American tribes through the new Nui Nui Food Pantry. Really what we're trying to just do is be a part of the community. You know, the Idaho Food Bank has always been a part of the community and that's just continuing today. The pantry was created during the COVID-19 pandemic, and the goal was to try to alleviate some of the hardships the Duck Valley Indian community were facing as they tried to get much needed groceries. About that time, the Duck Valley um, Indian Reservation, the Shoshone Paiute people um, went into lockdown. And because of the location of the reservation, it just made it impossible, almost impossible to get food. The Idaho Food Bank's community liaison, Jason Prettyboy, says the Nui Numi Food Pantry has been up and running since July of 2021. It primarily helps a community of 300 people on the reservation. We provide meals um, and that is our purpose in this. We supply them with food. They order from us once a month. Um, we stock their pantry and then they distribute it to the um, Shoshone Paiute people. But just like many other businesses and organizations, two years into the pandemic, shortages and rising food costs have made it hard for the Idaho Food Bank to keep fully stocked, especially during a time when people are relying on them. Pretty Boy says support from the community is still needed to help them continue assisting all of Idaho's communities. You know, I think a lot of times community members just need to look around and see who's actually doing the work and then from there they can find somebody to support real easily. And Pretty Boy says the pantry is open to anyone from the Duck Valley Indian community. And for those who would like to donate or support the Idaho Food Bank, they have more information on their website. And we'll have all that information on our website at K2B.com. Yeah, good to know. Getting help to the people who need it the most. So important. Thank you so much, Brenda. It's 31 degrees at 630.